something to do, something different. What is the goal in your life? Yeah. Become a famous rapper. Okay. How are you going to get there? I go to the studio, perform the shows. Do you think you need presentation skills? Most likely. Do you think Puffy goes into a corporate office and you know trying to get an endorsement or whatever from whatever company he's working with? Do you think he just walks in there and just because he's Puffy he gets it? No. He has to present a proposal. He has to present himself as a business owner, right? Just because you rap doesn't mean that you can't learn a lot of things, right? That you can't be well-rounded, okay? Learning these skills that you're going to learn from this camp is going to help you get work well-rounded, okay? This is not everything, okay? Some of you all, like you said, you didn't want to be here, but you're here. So while you're here, learn something. We're going to learn something today, okay? One thing is about getting outside of this comfort zone of, I'm going to sit over here, and I'm, I'm going to talk to this person, and I'm, I'm going to be, we got to get all of that out the way. Okay? You all are a team, you got to learn, learn about each other, talk to each other, network with each other. You may never see this person ever again. You never know. You may see him while you're in college. So, hey, we went to camp together. I don't know who you are. All right? Learn the people that you're around. Okay? And today we're going to figure out how that works out. Okay? Again, like I said, my name is Bryce Bowman. I work at uh, GE Aircraft. Now, there's three things we're going to talk about today. First thing is identifying your comfort zone. What is that? What do I mean by that? What, is, what does it mean to have a comfort zone? Or identify. Yes. That's something you know you kind of feel a little bit safe. What else? What else? Is Part of your comfort zone. Get up down here. Not sure? Yeah. It's fine. It's part of the cell. <laughs> this is around, you know, you're, you're, you're a different school. How many of you all have ever been to Davis University? Some of you all, it's not your first time. It's new surroundings, new environment, things like that. That's fine. Part of getting outside. Now, the next thing is, we're going to learn three elements of speaking. Okay? If you learn nothing else out of this session, just remember those three things. And you don't have to remember all the words. You know, like in a normal lecture, you got to take notes, you got to figure out, you know, what this test. We're not going to have a test. It's not a test. This is for you to get something out of it. Whether you get it out of it, get something out of it or not, it's going to ultimately be up to you. But I hope that what I convey to you here today is going to get through. And we're going to have a good time. Okay? Now, the next thing you're going to do is you're going to have a little introduction of yourself to help you get out of the comfort zone, to help you use some of the techniques we're going to talk about today. Okay? Now, a lot of you all look a bit, a bit tired. Okay? So, we're going to do a quick exercise. I didn't do this with group two. We're going to do this with group one. They were a little bit more energized. But that's all right. We're going to figure out how to get you energized today. What I'd like to do is invite everybody to be able to stand up with us. Get you some room. You know, you, know, you don't have to stand up right at your chair. But get you a little bit of room. Okay? We're going to do a little exercise. Wake you up a little bit. Okay? We ain't gonna do jumping jacks, we ain't gonna run around in circles or anything like that. You know, we ain't gonna wave our hands or anything like that. Okay? We're gonna do a little exercise. Something that somebody that's mentor of mine taught me. How do people wake up in the middle of the night? I don't feel like I don't want to do it. Okay? It's called alive, awake, alert. Okay? That's what it's called. Alive, awake, alert. Why is it called that? Because the game is to help you get alive, awake, and alert. Okay? Now, the motion is very simple. Okay, you're going to switch it up at the end here. Motion is very simple at the beginning. It goes like this. Just follow along with me, or you know, if it's the first time, just kind of look. Okay? I'm alive, awake, alert. Okay? I'm alive, awake, alert. I'm alert, awake, alive. 
I'm alive and away from the alert. You get that? No. Of course you're not going to get it the first time. No one gets it the first time. And that's what practice is all about. All right? Let's try it. Let's try the first thing. Okay? I'm alive, awake, alert. Everybody got that? Uh, let's try this. Try it again. I'm alive, awake, alert. How come I'm the only one that I keep? Everybody still trying to figure that out, right? You go this way, this way, and that way. Okay? Everybody ready? I want to hear everybody else. Okay, this is fun. This is, you know, you know, you test it on it. You have fun with it, right? I'm alive, awake, alert. Yeah, you got it. I want to hear everybody. All I hear is, all I see is, can we just play slow? No, let's see what it's happening. Let's try it one more time. I like to hear people. We're gonna keep we're gonna stay on the first side until we can try to hear somebody. Alright, let's get, get, get excited about it. Let's have fun. Alright? I'm alive, awake, alert. Good, that's a little bit better. We're gonna try it one more time. A little bit more enthusiasm. A little bit more loud. Okay? I'm alive, awake, alert. Wake up. <laughs> Not all the time. Every Keyboard work? It's just mouse work. Oh, 